So this is the way it turned out. Obviously, I'm not blonde. Oh. I have like streaks and it's not very pretty much oh god why okay <laughs> so pretty much the blonde parts like here they're really gross they're like hay textured and um it's today they're falling out by the clumps and it's kind of freaky I did a deep I did a deep condition last night and left it on my hair overnight and got up and washed it a couple hours ago. And I'm not really sure if it helped. It helped the dark hair, but the blonde hair is still falling out. And I can't really touch it or it'll fall out more. So um, I'm not having a very fabulous time with my hair right now, nor vlogging because I'm using my phone and I'm still trying to figure this out. <sighs> but pretty much, like I said in the other video, I went to the salon. It was like... We got there close to 1, like 12.40, and um, she put me in a cap and pulled my hair out, not literally pulled my hair out, but out of the little holes in the cap, and um, is supposed the cap is supposed to uh, keep bleach off the scalp, and she tied it down here twice, and they do not make it long enough. So, I had this thing, like, choking me for, like, three hours. It was pretty bad. And she put the Volume 40 bleach on it three different times. So, I was under the heater for, like, three hours. And I went to a salon. I don't think that was a very good idea. I think we should have done one application... Left it on for half an hour and then made another appointment. Because it did not do anything but make my hair fall out. Um, staff was really, really, really nice. But um, I'm just not really sure she knew what she was doing. And so it's still black except my roots. Oh, that's a little brassy. But my roots are like blonde and then I have streaks in it and it's really brittle and it's still black so it's not really what I expected um really I was just going to let it I don't know heal I'm not really sure oh god there's thunder okay so I'm gonna let it try to get back to normal and I'm going to try it myself this time because I think it won't be too bad really if I do it it was a lot worse when I actually went to get it done but you know you gotta try something I'm going to the beach next next Friday I gotta do something and I'm supposed to spend the night with my grandmother tonight, but I'm not sure if I really want to. Because she's really, she used to do hair. So she's really like, oh man, I don't, I don't know. I'm afraid to like go up to me like, hey, and she's like, what happened to your hair? And I'm like, well, tried to bleach it because I'm going to, you know, put bam bright red in my hair. She, I'm like, uh, bleached it at a salon. And then she tried to, because I was going to do something else in my hair one time. She got me an appointment with one lady that she always goes to. But it would be like $100. So I'm like, I ended up backing out of it. Because I'm like, that's ridiculous. Really? $100. And, but even then we were going to make appointments to slowly bleach it. Because you, you can't just bleach it all in one appointment. 
I don't know why the lady I went to yesterday did that. Because now my hair is like horrible. But I'm going to try to save it somehow, some way. Hopefully I won't look ratchet when I go to the beach next week. But right now I've got stuff from Sally's like really damaged hair shampoo and conditioner. Uh, we washed my hair again <clears throat> with it last night. And then, um, use a shampoo and conditioner. And then we put the, like, it was a protein pack, I think. And I put it on my head overnight. And then I got up this morning and went and washed it. I was going to, like, maybe wash it with the shampoo and conditioner again. But after I saw that strands, like, whole like this coming out only the blonde's coming out by the way after I saw that coming out when I just rinsed the conditioner from last night out of my hair I'm like I, I don't think so I don't think that's gonna work out so I didn't and I'm glad I didn't because I would probably be bald by now but um yeah my hair was kind of getting actually thick so free thinning out I guess I don't know I'm just, I'm just kind of freaking out because this has never happened to me before and this video is getting really long. But yeah, that's what happened. I'm not really sure if I can give any tips on this, but. Oh, the sun. The sun is going away. You can't really see it anymore, but yeah, I can't pick my hair. It's gonna fall out. And she said I can't hair dry it or flat iron it. So I'm just leaving it natural and I can barely touch it. Is that a sign? I think that's a sign. But, um, yeah, Here, there's a little horror story for you, and this is getting very long, so I'm going to end this.